Okay, we are recording this interview for our recruitment process. Please explain to us why you want to attend this university. I have always been an artist, ever since I was a little girl living in Mexico. When I moved to America, my love for art was the only thing that I could take with me. America was frightening and I had no friends, so I painted pictures to pull myself to those dark times, but I have trouble making a living as an artist. That's why I want to go to this university, so that I can learn from the best, become a better artist, support myself, and be happy forever. Tengo buenas noticias. Entré a la universidad. Ah, estoy orgulloso de ti. Pero no obtuve la beca que quería. Y yo sé que no me puedes mandar dinero de México. Pero mira, yo no me arrepiento de haber tomado tiempo para mandarte a los Estados Unidos. Tiene que vender tu arte en el parque. Papá, yo. Maria, hi, what's up? I got it to the university! That's amazing! I mean, I've been working on my portfolio all summer, but I knew you would get in. Your art, it's amazing. Yeah, but I can't afford the tuition. Papa still wants me to go, but he can't send me any money. You work at the museum, so I was wondering. Yes? Do you think you could get me a job? <sighs> Look, I really wish I could, but I know they aren't hiring right now. But look on the bright side, Maria. You got into your dream school. I don't even have enough portfolio pieces to finish my application. But Andrew, I have no money. Please, is there anything I can do? I mean, there are all sorts of ways to make money. Have you ever tried selling your art? That's what I've been doing since I moved here. Andrew, look, I know I'm new around here, and we are an exactly best friends. But I've been applying all over the place, and I cannot find a job. Could you Help me out a little. Look, I have an idea. Just let me go home and get changed and I'll talk to you about it later, okay? Uh, wait, uh, are you going to be painting in the park again today? Yeah, I've almost finished last one, Yolanda. Can't wait to see it. I'll meet you there. Hey, Maria, what's up? That painting's amazing. So, how about this idea? That's La Soñadora? Yeah, I'm glad you like it. If I keep looking at this, how am I get some inspiration? Inspiration from me? Andrew, you're talented. Talented? Look, your art always turns out so much better than mine, and you know that. Look, I have another idea on how you can pay for the university, and you have to trust me. Okay. Promise? Of course. Thank you for helping me. Well, you know how I'm working the night shift tonight? The museum closes at 7. You just Come in before closing and hide in the restroom. I'll distract the other guard while you make your way to the back hall. That's where they store all the pieces waiting to be put on display. You only grab one piece, one. It'll take them at least a week to even notice anything is gone. You can finally go to the university. What? Are you crazy? Hey, look, I thought you said you would trust me. I mean, I do it myself, but I work there. They'll know it was me. How will we even sell it? Don't worry about that. I know a guy. You know a guy. Have you done this before? Andre, I wanted a job in a prison center. Mario, what else can you do? I mean, you didn't get the job and you didn't get that full scholarship you deserve. Somebody else is going to pay the money and take your spot. I'm sorry, Maria, but you have no other options. I mean, don't you want to make your father proud? I mean, he, he sent you here to follow your dreams. My father? He will never do something like this. Look, once you sell La Soñadora and you begin college, you'll never have to do anything like this ever again. Andre, I promise nothing will go wrong. Nothing. I have it all under control. Okay. I love my father, but what he doesn't know will kill him. I will make him proud no matter what.
And now for a feel-good story. A local student uncovers a crime and gets accepted to university. Andre Jordan, a talented artist from Brooklyn, discovered a thief who stole art from the museum where he works. Due to his quick thinking and fast action, the art was recovered and the thief was apprehended. The same day, Andre learned he was awarded the President's Scholarship. His art, La Sonia Dora, will be on display at the museum all month. Papa, regreso a casa. Confío en la persona equivocada. Cometí un terrible error y ahora estoy siendo regresada a México. <laughs> <laughs>